Hello everybody and thank you for joining us here at the Loveland Living Planet Aquarium once again. As the aquarium is closed for a little while, we don't want you to be, miss out and so we're bringing the aquarium to you every day at 3 p.m. Today we're going to be doing a neat experiment to show you some things about density. Now density is one of those words that you might have heard before, maybe not. What it is, is it's a way of saying how heavy something is compared to how big it is. For example, if you take a look at this here, it looks like these beads are floating in the middle of the water. If we shake it up though, and you look what happens, you can see that they all will sink to the bottom. This is not just water. We have two solutions in here. One, we have super salty water, which the beads float on top of, and then we have a layer of rubbing alcohol, which is lighter. If you look carefully, you can actually see the rubbing alcohol floating to the top. Not all water is going to weigh the same. You can see the beads are starting to float their way up as well. This is one that's super easy to do at home. Heat up some water, stir in as much salt as you can, and then add a layer of alcohol, and then see what floats where. If you use an egg, you might get some pretty interesting results, whether it's a hard boiled egg or not. Another neat way to show this is by looking at a couple cans of soda. These are both Coca-Cola and they are the same size. So you would think if they're the same size, they weigh the same. Let's see what happens if we put them into the water. I'm going to put them all the way down. We've got original Coke and we've got the cane sugar and stevia Coke. Now, if I let go of them, what do you think will happen? Do you think A, they'll both say sinking at the bottom? Raise your hand. B, you think one of them might float? Go ahead and raise your hand. C, you're not really sure. Well, let's find out as we let go. You can see that one of them is less dense than the other. That means it floats, whereas its friend sinks down. Density is extremely important to animals that live in the ocean. Depending on how salty the water is will affect how dense it is, and that can mean a lot for animals that float around like plankton their entire lives. They depend on water density to help get around. Density is what's going to let turtles be buoyant, fish use air in their bodies to go up and down. It's extremely important. Density also matters with plastic. Different types of plastic will float at different layers of the ocean. Sometimes coming up with a solution for one type of plastic that's floating in the top of the water, there might be another type of plastic that's floating lower in or even sinks all the way to the bottom. One of the easiest ways we can help out the ocean animals is just by trying to reduce how much we use. Thank you very much for joining us here at the Loveland Living Planet Aquarium, and we look forward to seeing you tomorrow at 3 p.m. once again.